Hello YouTube, it's your boy Vintage Sterling Finds back for another thrift store Vintage Sterling Finds video. So, um, if you like the content, please like, comment, subscribe, and if you want to see what I have for sale, mainly jewelry and watches, link will be in the description. This is a bonus video. I was out today at the thrift store and I saw this for $2.99. And I thought, wow, this looks like silver. Couldn't see anything, couldn't see anything. Then right here, International Sterling. So I paid $3, and let's pop this, we'll go to the garage and pop this off. Then we're gonna see for my $3 investment how much I got. And this is rare, this is my first time seeing one like this. So, let's go to the garage. So we're in the garage, safety protection, gloves, Sorry if the angle's a little bit weird. And we're just gonna pull this apart. I think I can by hand. Hmm. A little bit it's harder than I thought. making headway let me think for a bit so I couldn't get it we're just gonna try cutting it two hands again Let's pause it so I used the tin snips to cut a screwdriver to chisel I bent it cut bent it cut pride and now this should just unwrap he oh this is heavy this is heavy. So this we're gonna throw away. Then we're gonna fold this. We can just bend this by hand. See, we do this all by hand. Ah. Got a nice big chunk of sterling. Gonna throw this out, then we're gonna go back and weigh it. Um, I think it's about 100 grams. Let's see how close I am. So we're back in the studio. I'm thinking it's about 100 grams. Let's see, the battery's looking a little bit old. So we're at zero. Hundred and twenty-two grams. So that's about a hundred bucks worth of silver. Can you guys see that it's 122? 121.9, 122. But that's a good score. Um, unfortunately, it is worth more to take this out than to resell it because to resell it there'd be less value and the cost of shipping so next time i go to the scrap dealer i'll make a hundred bucks for my three dollar investment if you like uh, thanks for watching i hope you like it see you on the next one